in a secluded temple nestled within the quiet mountains of Ngaku, a nun named Chiono devoted herself to the study of Zen, under the guidance of the venerable monk, Bucko. Despite her unwavering dedication, Chiono found herself grappling with the elusive fruits of meditation for a protracted period. For months Chiono immersed herself in the teachings, sitting in meditation with utmost diligence, and yet enlightenment remained a distant, shimmering mirage. Doubt clouded her mind as she wondered if her efforts would ever bear fruit. One fateful night, the silvery light of a full moon bathed the temple grounds, casting an ethereal glow on the world. Chiono, carrying a pail of water, walked along a stone path, her heart heavy with the weight of her persistent struggle. The pail she held was old, its bamboo bindings showing signs of wear and weakness. As Chiona walked, her footsteps echoed softly in the moonlit stillness. Suddenly, with a resounding snap, the bamboo strips binding the pail gave way, and the bottom fell out, scattering droplets of water onto the ground. In that very moment, Chiono experienced a profound awakening, as if the moonlight itself had penetrated her being. The weight of her striving, the relentless pursuit of enlightenment, and the confines of her own mind, shattered like the broken bamboo. Free from the confines of her own efforts, Chiono's heart soared with newfound clarity and liberation. She realized that the very act of seeking enlightenment had been the source of her struggle. In the serenity of that moonlit night, she found what she had been searching for all along a profound realization that transcended words and concepts. In the wake of this awakening, Chiono returned to the temple and, in commemoration of her newfound freedom, she compassed a poignant poem. In this way and that I tried to save the old pail, since the bamboo strip was weakening, and about to break until at last the bottom fell out. No more water in the pail, no more moon in the water. Her poem encapsulated the essence of her revelation, the old pail symbolized her mind, weighed down by the burdens of seeking and striving. The bamboo strip breaking signified the moment when her efforts ceased, and her mind was released from its self-imposed constraints. The loss of water represented the relinquishing of all attachment and desire, and the moon and the water illustrated the illusory nature of the world, where everything is reflected, but nothing is truly held. Chiono's poem became renowned for its profound wisdom, and her experience resonated deeply with all who heard it. The story of the nun who found enlightenment in the simplest of moments, with a broken pail and the radiance of the moon, spread far and wide. As word of Chiono's awakening reached the wider Zen community, she became a respected teacher in her own right. She guided others in their practice, emphasizing the importance of letting go of striving and allowing enlightenment to unfold naturally, like a flower blooming in its own time. Chiono's teaching centered on the idea that true enlightenment is not something to be pursued, but something to be recognized within the depths of one's own being. It is not an attainment but a realization, a letting go of the mind's incessant quest for something more. Over the years, Chiono's temple became a place of pilgrimage for seekers from distant lands. They came not in search of complex teachings or esoteric practices, but in the hope of experiencing the profound simplicity that she embodied. Under the moonlit sky that had witnessed her awakening, Chiono continued to teach, her words carrying the weight of her own experience. She encouraged her students to release the pale of their own striving, to let go of the burdens that bound their hearts, and to discover the boundless freedom that arises when one simply rests in the present moment. Chiono's life and teachings served as a timeless reminder that enlightenment is not a distant goal, but a direct realization of our inherent nature. It is found not by seeking something outside of ourselves, but by letting go of everything that obscures our inner light. And so, the story of Chiono, the nun who found enlightenment in a broken pail and the moon's reflection, echoes through the quarters of time, inviting us to release our own burdens, to break free from the confines of our striving minds, and to recognize the ever-present moon of enlightenment that shines within us all.